smart homes. The name sounds futuristic, but it's technology of the present. It makes life really easy. <laughs> it makes it easier. Whether built in as part of the home security system or bought at any electronic store, the new wave of automation is boosting simple track homes into high-tech abodes. Oh, did I, did I set my alarm? Are my doors locked? You realize you can just get on your phone, hit a button that sets your alarm, and it also locks your doors. At Diaz Surveillance and Security, machinery comes as a fully enclosed system. The old days of the keypad on the wall and the box in the closet and all these peripheral devices spread all over the house are almost gone and this is what's coming and this is what's here to stay. Controlled through smartphones, tablets, computers, people use apps to lock and unlock their doors. I just hit this button and you can hear it. Armed security systems. Arming stay. And when the mood is right, the lighting can be manipulated by the power at your fingertips. Walking to turn off all of your electronics seems a little bit outdated when with the click of a button on your cell phone, you can control the entire room. But are you leaving yourself open for the possibility of a cyber attack? One that can take over access to your most personal paraphernalia. Can somebody interact with those things? You know, if they have the appropriate equipment, of course. Professor Bill Bard suggests cracking the code wouldn't be easy, as multiple layers of security have to be bypassed. But with your phone as the key, a break-in is unlocking the code. And if you've been compromised... If someone gains physical access to that device, it's like having the keys to the castle. Aaron Bryson is a security consultant with Silence, a cybersecurity company that uses mathematical formulas to help protect against advanced security threats. He says this is how to keep you, your family, your home protected. Turn on your device encryption. Make sure your operating systems are up to date. Know what apps you're downloading and if they're secure and lock your phone with a strong password or PIN. You definitely do introduce uh, some new level of risk and potential vulnerabilities, but at the same time, that new technology also buys us security in other ways. This technology is the present and the future. We'll all think back to and remember a time and be surprised that we ever lived in a time where we couldn't unlock the door with our phone. Arming stay. Adam Rakusen, KITV News.